The senior editor Gabe Seglier joins us live with a test drive. You look like you're cold. Yes, and weren't you just in Hawaii? <laughs> <laughs> that is, 48 hours ago, I was in Hawaii, and now I'm in a galaxy far, far away. Awesome. Uh, how do you like my X-Wing? I just got me here just in time for nice. this live shot cool. with you guys. Uh, and BB-8's up there. Hey, BB-8. Uh, yeah, he's a big cool. part of this, by the way. But as you mentioned, yes, this opens to the world officially tomorrow here inside uh, Disney's Hollywood Studios, Walt Disney World, Florida, uh, in, uh, in beautiful Orlando. And, of course, January 17th, put it on your calendars, in Southern California there in Anaheim at Disneyland. Uh, one of the most anticipated attractions uh, that Disney has ever produced. Um, I just got off this ride at 15 minutes, one of the longest attractions oh, that wow. Disney's ever put together. Uh, and if you if you're a Star Wars fanatic, you're going to love this. If you are not, you're going to love this anyway because of just how immersive this uh, this attraction is. First of all, the technology is mind-blowing. No track uh, in, in this ride. You've got multiple ride systems going uh, uh, simultaneously. Uh, the technology, the social, the simulation technology is just fascinating. Thousands of special effects from uh, lightsabers uh, that are slashing by and whizzing uh, bolts and exploding walls and massive oh. star fields. Uh, but the best part of of this guys is the immersiveness. Um, the fact is, you know, the rule book is thrown out. Most of the rides, you wait in line, you get a little briefing, you hop on the ride. Right. Here, you become part of the of the attraction itself from the very beginning. You become a resistance fighter. A quick snapshot of the storyline: you've you've just finished a devastating fight against uh, 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 against um, the um, the First Order, uh, and all of a sudden, you've got to find a secret camp uh, for the resistance, and you're making your way through the uh, remnants of this ancient civilization. You're about to take off to go meet the rest of the resistance off planet, and yet, wouldn't you know it, the First Order brings you back to the surface of the planet, and a battle of galactic proportions then ensues. Uh, but the, the fact that you're part of this ride, that you are a resistance fighter, is, is a fascinating thing. Um, you know, a lot of the actors that are part of the trilogy of Star Wars films that we're seeing out there now, Return of the Jedi, uh, The Rise of Skywalker, which is about to hit, hit theaters, they make an appearance here, um, and uh, they shot their appearances for Rise of the Resistance while while they were filming these films, so very much in character, very much on point. Um, and, and again, you know, the 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 yeah, technology is fascinating. This was a collaboration between Disney Imagineers and Lucas Films, almost six years in the making. So the attention to detail, as you can imagine, uh, is pervasive. And so even if you're one of these Star Wars fanatics, uh, I think you're going to be quite pleased. Wow, and that's cool. Amazing. 15 minute ride and six years in the making. I can only imagine. It's only gotta imagine. be good. It's gotta be good. Is that your new favorite ride now? Well, it is quite fascinating. You know, I think the Pirates of the Caribbean at 60 minutes is a little bit longer, but the fact that you are from the get-go sort of entering this uh, this experience, you're hopping on mm -hmm. this uh, on this uh, you know sort of technologically advanced uh, ride, uh, you know, makes it one of the best things I've done uh, at a uh, Disney uh, resort. The neat thing is that for a lot of the folks on the on the East Coast, they're going to start coming in uh, starting tomorrow. Yeah. But for those of us in, in California, we can make our way down to Disneyland. Uh, January 17th is when it opens up there at uh, Disneyland Resort. Also uh, part of uh, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge at 14 acres. These two worlds, both at Disney World and Disneyland, the largest expansion ever by Disney. So a lot of firsts here. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think cool. because it dovetails off of these great films that we're seeing hit theaters now, uh, an even more irrelevant uh, thing to do yeah. when uh, when it uh, hits uh, L.A. on December 17th, on uh, January 17th. Thanks, right. Gabe. Have Thanks, fun out Gabe. there. Bye. Good to see you. Thank you. All right, the fight goes on. Okay. All right, back to you. <laughs> All right, more good day coming up right after this.